Welcome to Python for Entrepreneurs. This course will teach you how to build the web app that you've been dreaming of, and more importantly, it'll teach you how to build your online business around that app. Hey there, I'm Michael Kennedy from TalkPython. And I'm Matt McKay, full stack Python author and a developer evangelist at Twilio. We're thrilled to teach you the hard lessons we've learned. Both of us have built thriving online businesses and want to share our hard fought knowledge. Yeah, building an online business is like looking at an iceberg. You see the product, the web application, but it's the unseen things that often are the what makes the business successful. Things like the credit card processing system, the deployment and operations, email lists, content marketing to reach potential customers and let them know about what you've built. It's all of these things combined that will make your app and your business succeed or fail. And we wanna teach you all of them in this course. We've built thriving online businesses, and we'll share all of our knowledge with you as we cover these topics. All right, so what app are we going to build? We'll build the e-commerce site for your and my favorite tech-based fictional rock band, Blue Yellow Rockets. A few things to note right from this screenshot here. The design is catchy. It feels pretty modern. It has secure account management via sign-in and register, credit card and e-commerce capabilities under the album's nav link, mailing list and subscription support via Get Notified, and all of that's just on the home screen above the fold. You'll learn everything as it's created live. If you try to watch people paste in pre-generated code, that's just not going to help you learn the right way. In this course, you'll see exactly how this application is built to understand how to successfully create your own app and business. While building apps and learning as you go can be engaging, it's also hard to follow a topic entirely in that format. That's why when we get to a new topic, we stop and we discuss them with clear and concise visuals. Here's an example of what we're gonna talk about when we hit credit card processing with Stripe. What's covered in this course? We'll start out with defining what success looks like for you and me, and a little bit of motivation to get you in the right mindset to build this online business and this web app. And then we'll move right on to course setup and configuration so you'll be ready to write code on your machine. Once your environment is configured, we'll give a brief introduction to the Python language and a refresher for those of you who already know Python. Then we'll jump into setting up your PyCharm editor and give an introduction to what this IDE can do for you. After that, we create a new web app from scratch. It's gonna look pretty basic in the beginning. That's why we're gonna talk about CSS fundamentals, not too much, but just enough that you'll be really comfortable designing the basics of our web app. Once we get the basics out of the way, we'll do some more intermediate topics with Pyramid, the web application framework we're using throughout this course. Then we'll dive into the source control with Git and using GitHub. Now it's time to make your app beautiful. We're gonna cover CSS front-end frameworks like Bootstrap and really put the shine and professional touch on our web application. Then we're gonna to talk to the database. Talking to databases in Python is super easy and we're gonna use the most powerful and popular library to do that called SQL Alchemy. Once you know what your application is going to be, we're going to switch gears a little bit and go into capturing and engaging users. We'll talk about setting up user accounts, establishing mailing lists, and handling content marketing. Then we'll go into search engine optimization foundations so that people can start to find what you're creating. Web apps are no fun on your computer. They have to be deployed somewhere to a data center. That's why we talk next about deploying to the cloud, setting up things like SSL, configuring Nginx, and so on. And of course, we wanna make money. That's why in this section, we focus on building credit card processing into our application. So far, you've done a whole lot of work yourself. So we're gonna go into getting help. How do you hire people for short-term tasks such as design, web application development, and content marketing? Then we'll cover scaling up. So what happens if your web application hits the news media? Well, you wanna make sure you can handle the huge influx of new customers. So it'd be great if your app is featured in all the popular press and you get tons of users. But oftentimes you have to work really hard with various techniques that maybe are not entirely obvious and certainly not out in the open. So we'll cover a bunch of sort of guerrilla marketing concepts under this growth hacking banner. And finally, we'll build a showcase of student creation. So when you go through this class and you build something amazing, you launch it, we will give you a place to show off to your fellow students and the rest of the world what you built. Then we'll finally wrap everything up in a conclusion and give you more resources and ideas for where to go next. So who did we have in mind when we wrote this course? Well, the ideal student from this course is someone who knows a little or a lot of programming and wants to launch an online business based around a non-trivial product. For example, 
If you've always spent your time middle tier programming at a big company and you want to break out of that mold and launch a competitor to Airbnb, then you found the right place to start. That'd be hugely challenging, of course, but it gives you the idea of who we had in mind. And if you don't know Python, that's okay. Just be sure to pick the Python Foundation Plus Entrepreneur Award so you get both classes, the Python basics and this course. Launch the business that you've been dreaming about and join the Kickstarter today.